I've been doing this side quest on COVID. Uh, and that sounds kind of weird to say, but for me, that's, that's kind of what it feels like, was like working on climate and then, oh my gosh, this COVID thing really deserves some attention. Um, and what I've heard from a lot of people in the, in the climate space, or people around me, they're, they're kind of stuck on this idea of like, well, should I, should I do this side thing or should I stick with the thing that I'm doing? And what I have seen, I've gotten this crazy boot camp over the last 20 days on COVID because what I've seen is that like going where the challenge is or going where the problem is that you want to work on is sort of like, uh, it's sort of like in Mario Kart. Like if everybody was staying on this one track that's going at a certain speed, but then you go over this side thing and there's this like crazy booster that makes you go super fast. So that's what I think COVID has been like in, in this moment is I see entrepreneurs and inventions and creations coming out of this uh, COVID accelerator that, that Ari and I have built together along with 750 other scientists, doctors, designers, developers. Um, is this idea that by, by staying in... I'm at a loss for words. It's 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 what you're passionate about, but that's you know that's on the cover of every freaking book title or whatever. But by like by going with that intuition, I've just seen it lurch forward and, and zip forward. And now I start to think about okay, well, what about back to COVID and climate and what's what's clear? Uh, you might just say, oh well, you kind of took a took a twenty day detour. But no, like I didn't take a 20 day detour. I'm coming back like faster and stronger and a little bit smarter <laughs> than before because what I see is I see such commonalities between the, the, the 20 days of the COVID accelerator and what I'm seeing in air mining and the, and the carbon industry is what I see are the people that step out with an idea where, where the idea is amazing or uh, kind of a what the, what I've seen is when people step out with that, that's what that's what grows that idea into a change that grows that idea into an impact. Uh, I saw that at the COVID accelerator because just yesterday we were part of a conference that was hosted by Tim Draper and I I introduced these people as the co-founder of Hospital Hero, the co-founder of Corona Care Card, the co-founder of Find COVID Jobs. Those projects, those people hadn't even imagined those things 20 days ago. But today, now that's that's their identity. That's that's their they're basically like COVID expert. If you were CNN and you wanted to understand what's happening with like support on the ground with helping volunteers support doctors and support nurses and support medical teams, the team that built Hospital Hero is now one of the world's experts in that. Even though 20 days ago, none of them had anything to do with that, that topic at all. These people working on, on marketing and nonprofit fundraising and programming uh, new apps, right? But they came together and they created this experience and the experience created expertise. And now I, I look back at seeing everything happening in, in air mining and the carbon industry. And I just see the same thing. I see those same types of people who step forward with an idea and maybe that idea is something amazing, like a new, totally amazing, like director capture machine. But maybe the idea is something that seems quite simple or kind of meh. But what, what I see is that those people that do step forward just so quickly accelerate into, into being the experts, into being the people that create that experience, into people that, that build these solutions for the future. Personally, I think of people uh, like the like like Ari on the on the open air team. I mean, coming from a marketing background and then stepping into we're gonna we're gonna build policy and we're gonna build hardware to to help direct their capture go faster. I see Heidi write an article a year two years ago about carbon removal and what she was seeing and researching, and that blog post transformed into a career in carbon removal. Like, how freaking cool is that? Or I think about Evan from Climate Careers, right? Like jobs for people who want to work on climate change, right? Like that seems like a, a somewhat of a simple concept, but you actually step forward with that. And just what I've seen in this space is just you immediately just zoom forward um, without like without hesitation. And so, you know, I go back to, to, to seeing, uh, seeing COVID and climate and thinking about 
gosh, where are the opportunities uh, in, in, in my own work and in, in your work to, where's that opportunity just like, that's how I'm thinking about this. Um, you know, go out and go out and do it, go out and try it. I, I tell that every day to people, uh, 700 people in the COVID accelerator. I just say, look, if you've got an idea, it's crazy, but what I've seen is just take it and, and build a team and start to grow it. And it just, whatever it is, it becomes a solution step-by-step, step, iteration by iteration. And it's so cool to look back at the, at the climate space and the, the air miners uh, and people that are part of the negative campaign and to see the same thing as people that are stepping into action. So see what opportunities are around you. If you've got an idea that, gosh, if you've been thinking about it for a year or even a week, uh, share it, tell somebody about it, find a team, f find somebody who's a designer, find somebody who's a programmer, talk with them about it and start that iterative process where it's, it's gonna, it's gonna improve it. It doesn't matter really what the starting idea is. All that matters is what is your, what is your growth rate? What is your, if your idea is junk and the growth rate is low, then, then whatever. But if the growth, if your idea is junk and your growth rate's high, you're going to beat something that's, that starts out as a, a better idea, but, but doesn't, doesn't grow and doesn't change. So get out there, whether it's climate or COVID or some other big challenge that the universe has, uh, go and go and work on it. So hit me up with, uh, with what you're, what you're making happen. And I, uh, look forward to hearing about it.